How's it going, meat eaters? Thanks for checking out our meter channel. At this point, I'm sure you all have meter and have been cooking your meat to absolute flavor bliss. We're constantly improving the product, the user experience, and building that food loving community that we are. You already have the best smart meat thermometer out there, so is it possible to make it any better? Yes, it is, and we did it. We listened to your feedback and have been developing the newest version of the sleek meat thermometer that you know. Meet the all new Meter 2 Plus. So, what's different? The brand new Meter Probe has five internal sensors and one ambient. The internal sensors are spaced throughout the probe with one sensor close to the tip. Why more sensors? This means that while I should still aim for the internal sensor to be at the center of the thickest part of the meat, there's a little bit more room for error. And having multiple data points will help me find the true lowest internal temperature that we're looking for. The app will show you the lowest internal temperature. Ultimately, this will help you in getting the perfect juicy results that you're targeting. On top of that, we've increased the temperature resolution so now you'll be able to see it to tenths of degrees giving you even more on the dot readings. And you won't be wondering, is anything happening when you've hit the stall or when you're resting your meat and the rise in temperature has drastically slowed down. This next generation probe's internal sensor has a limit of 221 degrees Fahrenheit or 105 degrees Celsius. So you can get that show-stopping brisket to even higher temperatures if you'd like. The ambient sensor max is 932 degrees Fahrenheit which is 500 degrees Celsius. Yep, you're thinking what we're thinking. You can do high heat sears with the probe in the meat. And that includes open fire cooking. Oh yeah. Be mindful that there's still a limit though. And the app will warn you when it's approaching the max. This next generation ambient end, it's in steel, which is why we're calling it the Full Metal Probe. There's only a small ceramic band to allow signals to travel out. With increasing the durability, this also means that you get to deep fry with this bad boy. Mmm, I can smell the kitchen grease already. The probe now charges a lot faster. That's because of our super fast charge technology. To get to 50%, it only takes 15 minutes. That's just about the time it takes for me to preheat the grill, season the meat, grab a drink, and queue up my cooking playlist. And at 50%, it'll get me through a 12 hour cook. All of these breakthrough upgrades, plus the probe is 30% thinner. So you can use it on smaller cuts of meat. Every product is rigorously tested, so you know you're getting the highest quality thermometer with lab-tested accuracy. They'll each come with a lab certification in your packaging. Kind of like certificates of authenticity, so I know if that autographed photo of Henry Cavill is real or not. It is. The charger also went through an elegant design upgrade. The new metal band is designed to help prevent water from entering the charger and provide smoother usability when you put the probe back in. In terms of Bluetooth range, we're using the latest and greatest in Bluetooth technology, giving you even more freedom from your grill. If you want to get onto Wi-Fi in the cloud, you'll still be able to. Make sure to watch our meter link and cloud prono video to learn more. Stuff that hasn't changed. It's still charged by one AAA battery, but with our updates, Energy efficiency is upgraded and the battery lasts twice as long as it used to. The charger still has nifty magnets on the back so you can stick it to your fridge, your oven, your grill. It even has a nice rubber foot to prevent it from slipping and sliding. Just make sure you don't stick it on any hot surface. Because of the differences in size, probes and chargers are not compatible cross-generationally, but you still use the same awesome meter app. Lastly, when you're cooking, make sure to leave the charger close to the cooker because it needs to stay connected to the probe. Depending on the cooker, you might not need to leave it as close, but it's still a good idea to leave it there as close as possible. We are so amped to see what masterpieces you cook up with your brand new shiny kitchen and grilling tool, the next product of Meter. 
To watch more Prono videos, get recipe inspirations, and keep up to speed with us, subscribe to this channel, follow us on social, and find us on meter.com. Happy eating!